together, but nothing came to life. But they've not given up. Months later, they sort out the power supply and bingo. Five, six long years of work. It's not the wall that it's working. I could not be happier. Hello, this is Impact. I'm Yelda Hakim. President Biden calls for America to have the backbone and courage to confront the gun lobby after a massacre at a Texas elementary school. 19 children aged between 7 and 10 were killed along with two teachers when a teenager opened fire. And how many scores of little children who witnessed what happened see their friends die as if they're on a battlefield, for God's sake? The long-awaited report into lockdown parties at Downing Street says there were serious failures at the heart of the British government. Boris Johnson has this message to MPs. We are humbled by the experience and we have learned our lesson. The British public were told normal life as we know it is a long way off, but that wasn't the case in number 10. Police in Pakistan use tear gas as supporters of the former Prime Minister Imran Khan march on Islamabad to demand new elections. That's all coming up here on Impact. Welcome back to the program. We start in the United States, where President Biden has issued an emotional appeal for backbone and courage to confront America's gun lobby after a gunman killed 19 children and two teenagers at an elementary school in Texas. The shooting at the Robb Elementary School in the city of Uvalde is the deadliest shooting at a U.S. elementary school since 20 children and six adults were killed at Sandy Hook School in Connecticut a decade ago. The teenage Gunman Salvador Ramos was shot dead by police at the scene. This report from Richard Galpin. Every parent's word.